Virgos, I'm here to do your weekly love reading for the month of June 2023. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and get started in you guys' reading. Thank you, Spirit. Spirit, guys, for coming and giving me an accurate, precise reading. Love reading for the sign of Virgo for this week. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, you have the Six of Cups. So someone could possibly be coming in to you guys to reconcile from your past. That's what I'm seeing here, Virgos. You have the Moon card. Eight of Cups. Knight of Cups. I don't know if you could see it. I'm trying to focus the camera, but Knight of Cups is here. So you have the Six of Cups, the Moon, the Eight of Cups, the Knight of Cups, the King Queen of Swords here. And you have the two of swords at the bottom of the deck. Seven of pentacles. High priestess. Page of wands. Four of pentacles. All right, Virgos. So let's see here. Give me just a moment while I'm taking this energy in. So someone from your past here is coming in to reconcile with you guys. They're coming in with the Knight of Cups with an apology, emotions, offer of love. They want to come in to work on this and to heal this connection here. This person could possibly be communicating with you through a letter, a card, Messaging, messenger, text messages, sending flowers with the card is what I'm seeing here. But you're not receiving this from this person. You have totally walked away from this person here. You are blocking your energy with the Queen of Swords and the Four of Pentacles. You do not want to work on this with this person, Virgo. You have totally walked away and checked out. Due to this person being very deceptive here with the Moon and the High Priestess energy. Hiding a lot of things here. Let me get a little more on this. Give me more on this reading for Virgos. You have the Queen of Swords again. You are blocking this person out. You are not trying to hear this person. You're not receiving this energy from this person, Virgos. Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Swords. You're definitely blocking this person. You're not trying to hear anything they has, have to say. This person has possibly messed with a Queen of Pentacles or someone else that they felt like were white material or someone that they could commit to. That's what they were doing behind your back and you found out about it. You have the Nine of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, you're not thinking about this person. You totally moved on with the Three of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Two of Swords at the bottom of the other deck. You have blocked this person. You moved on. Two of them cycle in your life. You're happy here. You spoke your peace. You told them that. And you do not want to reconcile with this person from your past. But however, Virgos, this person wants to reconcile with you. Your message is for the sign of Virgo. 
love messages for the sign of Virgo. You are very cold towards this person. You're not letting them in at all. You said what you had to say and you're gone. You said what you said, literally. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Exactly. You moved on. You're very positive. You had a fortune period in your life. You are happy with this nine of cups, but you do not want this person here. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. And this person could possibly feel this way about you as well. They feel a strong connection with you, but I feel like you do not want this person. Heart to heart conversation. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. Like I said, you already said what you had to say. But this person wants to come in and tell you more with this page of wands and this ace of swords. And so religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and your spiritual path. So you could possibly have prayed about this situation, thought about it, meditate on it, went on with your life, went on to do some self-healing, and you do not want this connection anymore. But this person, Virgo, does want to come in and reconcile with you. I do see some type of emotion that they have for you, but I'm not convinced that this person is really, really deeply there in love with you guys, Virgo. I feel like this person is getting a kick off just coming back to see if they can get you back, but they not. You're very cold toward this person, very guarded, and I feel like you know that too. Okay, Virgos, if this resonates with you guys, please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next week.